On the corner of Neuwilhelmstrasse and Unter den Linden is a tavern, serving over 900 kinds of liquor and nicknamed the Black Pig, a meeting place for writers, amongst them, now living in Berlin, August Strindberg, who holds court in the Black Pig, where, in the words of a historian, he is virtually a tourist attraction for the intelligentsia. Laura Marholm, journalist, who with her husband has given financial aid to Strindberg, a source of growing resentment to the poverty-stricken Swedish celebrity. With Strindberg, in this room, are as many Scandinavians as there are Germans. Christian Krogh, who has accompanied his wife Uda to Berlin, where he watches her intense love affair with the Norwegian author Gunnar Heiberg. Sigborn Obstfelder, and next to him, Bengt Litforsch, Swedish botanical student, recently engaged to a 12-year-old girl. Hermann Stettgen, <laughs> painter and engraver. In this room, a center of the literary storm that is to sweep over Europe, are those who have already rejected naturalism, who are now seeking an artistic or literary means of presenting the interior macrocosm of the soul, peering into the darkest abyss of man. Here, in the words of a historian, ideas change hands faster than mistresses. Here the writers feed upon the staccato genius in their midst. August Strindberg, in self-exile from Sweden, where he has been condemned as a blasphemer, where educationalists clamor for the suppression of his books, and where he is spat upon by parents in the streets. Within this room, all is discussed. Art, black magic, spiritualism, the philosophy of Nietzsche, the erotic work of the Belgian etcher Felicien Rops, such as thievery and prostitution rule the world. Richard Demmel, currently writing a cycle of poems about sex. Their purpose, to raise sexual love to the level of religious mysticism, shortly to be prosecuted because of his description of a nun masturbating. Stanislav Szubyszewski, Polish-German author and medical student, involved with the occult, studies Satanism, who rewrote the opening of the Gospel of St. John to read, in the beginning, there was sex. And Edward Munch, famous overnight as the center of a storm that has rocked the German art world to its very foundations. Already, he has received invitations to exhibit in Dusseldorf and Cologne, and he has been prevailed upon by the Berlin intellectuals to make his home here in Germany. room, two will have the most marked effect upon the work of Edward Munch. Stanislav Szubyszewski, who is to later believe that his passionate interpretation of Chopin will have more meaning for German literature than all his writing, and August Strindberg, divorced, separated from the children he adores, who presents the black pig with a triple credo, woman the inferior, woman the whore woman, the man-weakening vampire. <laughs> 